So for this exercise, I have a series of small pieces of half-inch square bar. What I want you to watch here is where the thread is concentrated. And you see with the half-inch bar, you've got to work a little bit harder. how the thread is basically uniform from about here to here, but at the very bottom and the very top, the thread starts to get a more increased pitch between the uh, tops of each individual cut. That's because the heat in the center of the bar was greater than that at the end, where the metal bleeds into cool material at the top and at the bottom. The section in the center is relatively consistent in pitch. The reason for that is that this area was all the same temperature, so the force is applied equally. We're going to now modify the twist by modifying temperature. Now, although you can't see this too easily, I've taken and poured water on two spots along the edge of this bar. Hopefully, that'll be reflected in the turning as we twist this bar down. Alright, the effect here is a little bit subtle but I believe you can still make it out. The area the water was poured was here, and also from about here to there, that short section between my fingers. You can see how there's a slightly different pitch here and a very different pitch there. The cooling effect combined with the heat sink effect at the top of the bar at the top has really changed the pitch. Here, a certain amount of heat was able to bleed from the two heated sections into this section in the middle where the water was poured, but even still, there is a change in the thread. Now, for this last bar, What we'll do is we'll do a reversal thread. So, you've got to work very fast to get this to work properly if you want to do it all on one key. Lay down your first set of twisting, taking care to keep the bar as straight as possible. Notice the change because of the heat. Two small areas have been covered in water, cool, frozen. Now I'm turning in the opposite direction. If you watch the areas that are still hot, you will see the thread come undone in those areas and begin to turn in our new direction. 